It actually started two years ago this week. Uh, I um, was doing public art around the area here, painting murals on uh, uh, sewer pumping stations, uh, electrical control boxes. And uh, I realised that painting um, in, the, in the open air doesn't last. So I was looking for something that had a little bit more substance, lasted a bit longer and would outlive me. At the end of the day, I wanted to create something that our community was really uh, engaged with, uh, was excited about, could have a part to play, and from my own personal perspective would leave a legacy far beyond the time that I was living here. This wall has uh, contributions from um, two different indigenous groups, it has contributions recognising the South Sea Islander groups, we've involved three schools. Well I did some calculations and it's between 90 and 110,000 tiles, so let's say it's 100,000 tiles for nice round numbers. Projects such as this doesn't um, uh, come without the support of some major groups and the REDF, the Regional Arts Development Fund, um, provides uh, funding for projects such as this. And I think, um, I think very much that the fact that this has involved a whole of community uh, input into it is exactly what the RADF would be wanting to see. I'm looking forward to seeing the community really celebrate what we've been able to achieve together. 200 people have been involved in this project, all together put in over 6,200 hours, and it's been amazing and it's been fantastic to have so many people involved.